Hello, hello, good people of YouTube. It's Monday, December 8th, and I'm your host, Wolf Tiger. And it's time for another fine episode of The Things That Make You Go Hmm. The series that takes an editorial, and sometimes sarcastic, look at the realm of video games and technology. Well, after being sick and out of action for an entire week, it feels good to get back to doing the things that I enjoy, like eating. And on to the news. Well, Ubisoft fans, it seems this entire Assassin's Creed Unity launch saga is finally over because Ubisoft has just announced that Patch 4 will be coming soon and it should take care of the remaining issues from that disastrous launch, specifically in the area of frame rate problems. Let me get you more details on this story. From GameSpot.com we see the following. The next patch for the open world action game, Assassin's Creed Unity, should fix most of the title's remaining issues, publisher Ubisoft says in a post on its live updates page. This patch, the game's fourth major update, should be released soon, though an official launch date was not announced. Unity Patch 4 promises to bring improvements to the game's overall frame rate, and it should also fix crashes and clear up issues with the title's companion app. Although the forthcoming patch for Unity should fix up the game's remaining issues, Ubisoft says if you continue to encounter bugs or experience new ones, you should reach out to customer support. Alright, nice job Ubisoft. You actually went out and took care of your responsibilities. There was a serious problem and you actually fixed it. You caused an issue for your customers and you actually took the responsibility to actually fix your problem and listen to your customers. Good job. You get a small hand clap. Well, enough of that. That's just silly. We all have responsibilities to take care of. There's always going to be issues that each of us see in our own lives that we have to take care of on our own. And we don't get a pat on the back and a sticker every time we fix our own problems. If you tip over the trash can and spill a bunch of crap all over the floor, you don't get a sticker for actually getting on your knees and picking up all the stuff you spilled. No, you just clean it up and go about your business. So we shouldn't pat Ubisoft on the back and say thank you, you did such a wonderful job for actually fixing the problem they caused. No, if anything, this should serve as a warning to anybody who goes out and buys into the hype trains for those next exciting titles and just has to go pre-order before they've actually seen the game in their hands. That's just dangerous. Look at the things we've seen over the last couple years with games coming out in beta state all because so many people pre-ordered the game all the hype was just building and building only to be disappointed with the product that they received. It's not going away people. If we keep pre-ordering titles and buying into the hype, developers are going to keep taking shortcuts and giving us beta titles. We have to put our foot down and say no more betas. Give us an actual finished game and we're going to hold you accountable. If you keep giving us betas, we're going to stop buying your games until you actually give us a finished product. That's right, complain all you want, but as long as you keep spending the money, those companies will never listen. If you want Ubisoft and other companies that are guilty of giving out beta games at release, there's only one thing you can do. Put your money where your mouth is. Don't buy games from that publisher until you see a change. As always, we'll keep our eyes open and see what happens next. That's all for now. Peace out.